Hello hatchlings, and welcome to another quack talk. Uh, this time I'm going to be talking about mistakes. Um, I don't know if anyone else kind of feels this way or kind of goes through these things, but I thought I would talk about it to kind of see who else kind of felt this way, who else kind of goes through it, or if it's just me and <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but I feel like if I'm feeling it, somebody else must be feeling it, so... Why not share it? Um, okay, so the topic, mistakes. Um, every time like I make a mistake, whether it be big, whether it be really small, something that, you know, doesn't really matter all that much, <laughs> um, I tend to kind of treat it, I guess, as a be-all and end-all kind of end-of-the-world, I guess, situation, where if I screw up, I'm, like, the worst person ever in history, I can't do anything, um, I feel really crappy about myself, um, I get extremely, like, low self-esteem, low confidence, and I just don't really feel too great about myself in general because I've messed up and I feel, I guess, pathetic and worthless and kind of all those things um, that were kind of, I guess, taught to me and my emotions throughout, like, growing up and stuff. Um, I don't know if anyone else feels this way. Um... Or if it is just me, I do know that it's something that I need to work on and kind of finish because, like, w work on and hopefully, like, no longer feel this way. Um, I'm not sure if it's something that will constantly stay with me and that I'll just have to keep working through throughout my life and just understand that mistakes happen, they're going to happen, and the idea is that I need to learn from them. Um rather than treating it as the end of the world, I need to kind of be like, okay, well, I made this mistake. Time to rectify it and fix the situation. Um, like, I am doing my best to do that and kind of, like, better myself, make sure I am a lot better as a person, improve and all of that stuff. But it does get to me quite heavily, and I don't know why it gets to me quite so heavily. Um, I don't know if it's something that was just simply ingrained in me when I was younger, or if it's just... I don't even know. <laughs> All I can think of is just it being ingrained in me since I was little, and that's something that I've kind of got to like work through. I don't know, but I wonder if anyone else kind of feels this way, because I, I really, I try not to, but every, like every now and then, or like a lot of the time, it still gets to me, even though I try not to, and I do understand that making mistakes is normal, we're human, it's, it's going to happen, as long as we learn from them, that's fine. Um, I don't know. I don't know if it's because I like to be a bit of a perfectionist, I guess, and I have, like, mild OCD and everything needs to be perfect and in its place. I don't know if it stems from that or childhood or... I don't know. <laughs> but I was curious and interested to see kind of who else felt that way and maybe share it to kind of... I don't know, share it. <laughs> May as well share some deep and personal things so that you can kind of get to know me a little better. Um, and this is, is like just one of my flaws. This one of my flaws of just kind of getting beat up and beat down about myself, <laughs> I guess. Um, so I'm I am working on it, I promise. But I do want to know who else feels that way. I guess so. I don't really feel alone and all that crazy. But, uh, thank you for uh, watching and listening to it. If you enjoyed it, you can waddle over to the like button and sub to subscribe to become a hatchling. And I'll hopefully see you all in a wingspan. Because I 
upload these videos every week. It's Sunday 5pm and 6pm in Australia town time. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed. See you later. Wow.